Hello YouTube! I have a kind of a different video today, so uh, today I actually have a craft to show you guys. Uh, all you need for this is scrapbook paper, a glue stick, and scissors. And that's it! And we're gonna make some bookmarks. So I will go ahead and get started. So today I will be showing you how to make bookmarks with scrapbook paper, which is super easy. So all you need is some scrapbook paper, uh, preferably six by six inches or even smaller. Um, I got this from my mom and then one day I was like, hey, these would make really cute bookmarks. So if you have a larger scrap of paper, that'll work, but you'll just have to cut it down some. So I've picked out a couple pages that I want to turn into bookmarks. I thought this one was appropriate since it kind of looks like it has little open books on it. So. Um, the scrap of paper book that I have has this edge with a hole in it at the top, so I'm going to cut that part off because it's, um, there's a dotted line here that you can cut across. So, do that. So I've got an uh, example here of one that I've made before, so I'm going to use that to fold this to be the right size. Because uh, if you fold it in half, um, it's a bit big. You can see this is kind of a huge bookmark, so I want it to be this size. Which, I guess if you're measuring, it's about two inches wide-ish. But it doesn't have to be perfect. Just however you want your bookmark to be. Fold there to be the right size. Alright, so now we've got this. So I'm going to cut off this excess. And now we have this. So the last thing left to do is to use your glue stick, which, I don't know if you can tell, mine has seen better days. I'm not even sure this is not expired or something. I'm pretty sure I got this in college, which was a long time ago, but it seems to do the job. So just take your glue stick and just go over one side, like one half of the folded paper. Um, there's no need to do both halves. Um, this may get on your table or whatever you're doing this on a little bit, so if you don't want that to happen, then maybe put something down first. Um, but make sure you especially get the edges and the corners so that it doesn't come up on the edges. Oops. Come on. Alright. So I think that's pretty well done. And then you just fold it back and kind of push it down a little bit, make sure it sticks together. And right now it's a little flexible, but if you give it a minute, then the glue will dry and then it will be more sturdy like this one. So now you have a new bookmark. So if you end up making some of these bookmarks, I'd love to see pictures of your creations. So um, put them on Twitter and tag me so I can see all your awesome bookmarks. Um, and if you liked this video, uh, let me know. I'm not the craftiest person in the world. This was kind of a rarity for me to come up with a craft like this, but uh, if you like this, then let me know and maybe I can come up with something else uh, involving books and crafting. So hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching.